Why does PyCharm's inspector complain about D equals? When initializing a dictionary with D equals, PyCharm's code inspector generates a warning, saying, This dictionary creation could be rewritten as a dictionary literal. If I rewrite it D equals that the warning goes away. Since, already is a dictionary literal, I'm pretty sure the message is erroneous. Furthermore, it seems like both D equals, and D equals dict are valid in Pythonic. This related question seems to conclude that the choice is just a matter of style slash preference. Differences between D equals dict and D equals. Why would PyCharm complain about D equals? Update. Mac nailed it. The warning actually applied to multiple lines, not just the one that was flagged. PyCharm seems to look for a sequence of consecutive statements where you initialize a dictionary and then set values in the dictionary. For example, this will trigger the warning. But this code will not. What is the code following your dictionary declaration? I think PyCharm will trigger the error if you have something like As you could have written Note, the fact that the error goes away if you use the function dict. This doesn't necessarily mean that PyCharm believes dict is a literal. It could just mean that it doesn't complain about it. This can be disabled in the project settings or default settings. Navigate to settings in GT, inspections in GT, Python, unchecked dictionary creation could be rewritten by dictionary literal. For those who like, just like me, to initialize dictionaries with single operation, instead of many lines like. In the end I ended up with this. High Charm is not complaining on this. I have a situation where this warning is bugging the hell out of me. In my case, I'm populating my dict partially as literals and partially from a tuple output by a function, like so. So, unless I create interim bars for the output of get underscore other underscore values, PEP8 generates this warning even though I'm creating the dict with literals. And I can't assign the C and D keys in the literal, since the values are output as a tuple. If you want to see more, please consider subscribing.